Merry Christmas, my dear brothers and sisters in Christ across our Anic Diocese. On Christmas Day, Christians start the first of 12 days of very big celebration because it's a season of great joy. And it's not a joy that originates on earth. Even though one advertisement I saw before Christmas said, joy to the world, your shopping's done. No, it's a joy that comes straight from heaven. And that's what Luke 2 tells us. On that first Christmas day, the angel who is from heaven said to the shepherds, do not be afraid. I bring you good news of great joy that will be for all the people. Today in the town of David, a savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. So you see, the joy of Christmas comes because God brought to the world the gift of rescue, planned from the beginning of the world, in this little baby born in a stable in a small city called Bethlehem. And that's the fulfillment of the Old Testament, in which throughout it, God is known as the one who rescues his people. He rescued Noah through the flood. He rescued Joseph in Egypt. He rescued the Hebrew people from slavery through the waters of the Red Sea. He continually rescued David from his enemies. And there were promises through all the prophets that God would one day rescue his people through a Messiah, one anointed by God, God himself. And so finally, on this first Christmas day, the world was able to clearly see God's saving work for all time. In this baby Jesus, who people could touch and hear and see, we see our perfect once and for all rescue. So it's not a philosophy or a way of life or special knowledge that saves us. It is Jesus himself who was born a baby and grew up to die for the sins of the whole world. He takes us to the place of safety with God by forgiving our sins. He provides for our future so that we can be with him forever. This is indeed good news of great joy. It's news that is worth telling people in your life about because it is the very light of God that fills any darkness that we can experience in this world. So I pray that God will bless your conversations about Jesus in this season and in this year to come. Dear friends, By the grace of our Lord Jesus, may you rejoice with all your heart, mind, strength, and soul this Christmas, because our Savior has come. Amen. Amen.